Hello everyone, it's your girl Uptown Beauty and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm bringing you guys a how-to tutorial on how to do this heatless overnight curls. Now, this is my first time doing them and I really like the outcome of the, of the look. So if you want to see or learn or watch how I do my own hair to get it to style like this, just please keep on watching this video and I'll show you my tips and tricks on how to achieve this hairstyle. I hope you guys enjoy it. Okay guys, so what you're going to need is a satin scarf, a twist and defined curling cream or hair gel, a comb, just as the one that you're seeing right now, and a scoochie to secure your hair. Now the first thing that I like to do is part my hair right in the middle. You can part it on the size, however you like, is up to you and of course your preference. Now the next thing that I like to do is start parting my hair sideways and you can, I pick the thickness of like the, of like two fingers, but you can uh, choose the thickness as you want. You can put it more thinner or more thicker. It's up to you. Now I like to comb my hair thoroughly, making sure that there aren't any knots. And then I grab my styling lotion and start distributing it all over my hair, making sure that each strand has a little bit of the product, and especially towards the end because my hair is really frizzy on my ends. I had to cut them. <laughs> so now we're going to start twisting our hair onto our scalp. So you kind of want to do this like a braid, but instead of three, instead of using three strands, you're going to just be using two strands. And once you're done with the strand, what I like to do is curl the bottom to make sure it does not come off or start falling apart, just as you see me doing in this video. And I'm so sorry about the products on my ear. I didn't realize that I had it until I started editing, so my apologies to anyone that might be disturbed by it. <laughs> So again, I'm starting the second one at the same thickness, about two fingers. And it is important that you comb your hair through that, making sure that there aren't any knots. Again, I'm grabbing some of the products, um, some of the product and applying it on my ends and throughout my hair. Now, I did notice that I applied for this hairstyle a little bit too much of the product. So please make sure to just grab a decent amount and not too much because um, white, like I had a little bit of white residue at the end and we don't want that. <laughs> and again, I'm doing this for another section of my hair. Now I'm gonna do like a round bowl around my hair. Feel free to style or do the twist out braid. Um, however you desire is definitely up to you. You can get as creative as you want But for me, I just did like a bowl because it was just easier to do um, And yeah Now, I'm, now I am working on the right side of my hair and for the right side, I am working the twist in the direction clockwise. For the left side, I did it counterclockwise, so please be aware of that. If you want your twist to come out having a little bit of volume on the top. And uh, this is pretty much it. Now I'm working on the last twist out braid, which is in the back. And as, you, as I mentioned earlier, I, I do kind of like a beach ball style. Um, and the ones in the back, the direction doesn't really matter. Um, but yeah, this is how your twist should be looking like right now. And yeah, pretty much it. Mm, yeah, bouncing. <laughs> and yeah. Now what I did was grab my satin head scarf and 
you don't have to do this step, but because I was going to bed and I didn't want my twist to be moving around or get frizzy, I did use a head satin scarf. But if let's say if you do it in the morning, you don't have to do it. But if you're going to sleep, I highly recommend so. So now this is kind of like the next day and I'm, I am taking out my scarf and I am shaking out my twist and kind of just opening it up and stretching them. And before you open the twist, please be very careful. Like don't just run your fingers through it. Just be very lightly like and careful with it and start opening them, opening them up really carefully. Like because you, if you don't do this, then it might mess up the curls that you already have on your hair. And yes, girlies and guys, this is pretty much it. This is pretty much how I do my twist out and I really like it. I just use pretty much one product to uh, style it and then I'm using this oil just to kind of um, add a little bit of shine to my hair and give it a little bit more volume. Just feel free to shake your hair up and open those twist out ups. And yeah, this is pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, please feel free to comment below and also to follow me on my Instagram at Uptown Beauty. I love you guys. Bye-bye.